Hey everybody, I got a little project for you. Today we're going to make a barometer. What in the world is a barometer? A barometer is a tool that a meteorologist might use to measure atmospheric pressure. Now the one that we're going to make today is going to be very simplistic, um, but it's something that you could probably do at home with materials that you already have. So, let's go ahead and do this. Uh, one of the things you're going to need is a soup can. Uh, it's nice to have a sturdy one. I have cream of mushroom. Uh, delicious on its own or in pancakes. Uh, another thing you're going to need is some tape, uh, popsicle stick, uh, index card, and a balloon. If you don't have a balloon like Mr. Wigan, um, I have a rubber glove. Now, I know, I know, I shouldn't be using a rubber glove for a craft project right now, but this has been used and this is on its way out. So I figured, you know what, let's reduce, reuse, recycle, repurpose. Um, so that's what I'm gonna be doing with my rubber glove. Um, so let's get started. Uh, oh, one last thing you need. Sorry, almost forgot, rubber band. I'm gonna take my soup can and I'm gonna put my rubber glove over the top of it. Now, what you wanna do is you wanna make sure you get the top of that soup can nice and smooth. You don't want any creases or wrinkles uh, in the top. So pull that glove or balloon nice and tight over it. Ah, uh, yeah. That's looking good. Like that. And now what you're going to do is you're going to take your rubber band. And you want to try to get that really, really tight um, around it. So that is not going to budge. Uh, ideally, we are creating um, an airtight seal around the top of that can. So, hopefully, that's what we've just done. So, there we go. Uh, the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to take my popsicle stick and I'm going to tape it right into the center of my can. So, get my tape. Oh, yeah. We're looking good here. See that? Boom! Right in the center. So I got my popsicle stick on there. I got my, uh, you know, rubber glove on there. Last thing I want to do is I want to take my index card and I am going to try to tape it. You know what? Let's fold it. Let's fold it like this. See how I did that? And uh, I'm going to put it right here uh, so that. Um, it's right next to the popsicle stick. Ta -da. Okay, check that out. Now, Mr. Wigan, how in the world does this measure atmospheric pressure? This is ridiculous. I'm so glad you asked. Now, atmospheric pressure. Now, if, if the pressure around us increased... If there was a lot more pressure on us right now, what would happen to the top of this can? Um, if the pressure around us decreased, what would happen to the top of this can? Um, I, I don't know. I can't wait to find out. So what we're going to do, I'm going to take my pen, my giant pen, and I'm going to put a line right where the popsicle stick is. There. Now I've got, uh, I don't know, a baseline, so I know exactly where I started off. Hey, another thing I'm doing, which it might be worth doing if you have one, uh, I have a thermometer. I'm going to make sure I know what temperature it is right now. It is 22 degrees Celsius, um, because, you know, actually, temperature would have uh, something to do with whether this moves up or down as well, not just pressure, but um, as long as I always have the same temperature, I can trust this to be uh, an accurate measure of whether the pressure around us is rising or falling. Uh, so anyways, um, there you go. We've got our barometer. Hopefully you were able to make one too. Uh, what, 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 why, why do we need to know about pressure? What does that even have to do with weather? I'm so glad you asked. Uh, go look it up. What does pressure have to do with weather? You see 
uh, those L's and you see those H's on um, the weather report. What do those actually mean? Uh, sometimes, you know, I, I see that oh, we have a low pressure system coming in. Well, so what? What does that have to do with weather? Go find out. Let me know. If you do, I'll give you an e-cookie. All right. Go make your barometer.